Hello everyone, today we're going to talk about registered agents. If you're setting up a company, you're setting up a business out in the United States, you're interested in working out what is required and what are the legal requirements for you. Um, one of the things that you may have come across is a registered agent and today we're going to talk about what a registered agent is. There's a couple of resources I wanted to redirect you to. Firstly, there's a great video if you're really into kind of video content, which I, I believe you are as you are on YouTube. So this video on what is a registered agent um, by the Northwest Registered Agent is um, probably the first place to start uh, after you have obviously watched this quick introduction. Effectively, business entities like LLCs and corporations that you're probably looking to set up because you want limited liability, um, they're required to appoint a registered agent when they're formed. So this is one of the key requirements. So having a registered agent when you can set up when you set up an LLC is going to be critical. So whether you're setting up an LLC somewhere else or you're doing it both together with an organization like Northwest, you're going to have to do both of these things, setting up the LLC and then getting a registered agent too. Um, every state is different um, and you need to have a local registered agent in the state that you transact uh, your business. So for example, if you're set up in Wisconsin, you need to have one there. If you set up in New York, you need to have one there, etc. And then in terms of what's the requirement in terms of the registered agent, um, the due process states that before the lawsuit or in any other legal action can move forward in the courts, all parties must be properly notified. And then so the most basic function of the registered agent is to ensure that the business is notified when it's involved in a lawsuit. That's kind of effectively the key thing. It's their job to make sure that you are notified and you are, you know what is taking place when something like that is about to happen. Um, yeah, so, I mean, this is the key thing that uh, is a requirement for having a registered agent when you're setting up your LLC. Um, and it needn't be expensive. I think Northwest is, uh, is one of the really kind of good uh, players out there, well-known, well-renowned, five-star reviews on... Uh, lots of different platforms um and uh and then you know the best way to kind of show you what to do is you'd effectively come on this website i've got a link below um and you can do the same um is to select a state and I'm, for this purposes i'm going to kind of assume it's in new york um so i will click on new york and straight away it goes to the new york registered agent Kind of profile and 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 what this is is this is kind of really localized to what you need within new york um and again it will talk about for example the specific state codes of law um and here for example these uh this like law l um law 302 for example states that the agent must be able to accept any notice demand or service or proposed process required by law to be served on the business and that's effectively their job as your registered agent um uh, and, and again, effectively, through clicking on that link below, you can do the same, you know, click on the state that you're in, come through to this page, which will be almost like the home page for your state's registered agent. And it will talk you a little bit around kind of what are the requirements, what the, what's the statute involved. Um, and um, and then again, you've got further links here around, um, you know, if, if, for example, FAQs, if we check out the New York FAQs, and again, this will be the same for um, effectively the different states as well. It will talk about you know the requirements you know you have to have one um, for example um, and uh, then I think effectively it will also give you kind of tips on what how to save money in terms of having an, an LLC locally um, uh, so for example it'll say can you be your own registered agent yes you can um, the address of the registered agent's name and address becomes part of the public record Right. So you can effectively be your own pub registered agent. That's not necessarily a problem. But effectively, if you want that kudos, if you want that kind of that prestige from day one, the best thing to do, bar none, is to have a, a reputable registered agent with their address representing you effectively. Um, and then you've got things like specific things like the biannual statement, and it will tell you kind of lots of things that are really particular to that state. I mean, I won't necessarily go into detail because you might not be living in New York and so this might not be relevant to you best thing to do is click on that link below go through select your state 
and check out all the different information that you want to do um, uh, before you set up your registered um, agent. And, and I really, really recommend Northwest. Um, I mean, there's a couple that I really uh, would recommend it, but not Northwest is, is is one of them. And then it tells you kind of effectively what the step by step guide is for for doing it. You know, um, you sign up online. You know, they collect the first year's registered agent service fee up front, um, and uh, yeah, and then it just literally steps walks you through this process, and it's about six steps. Um, and 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 before you know it, you're kind of really you've, 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 your 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 limited liability corporation LLC is, is set up, which is fantastic. Okay, so I mean, I will leave it there. Click on that link, have a look, see what you think. Uh, also, please like and subscribe to my channel. Really, kind of would appreciate that. Um, you know, and we're here to really just try to bring you really good content when it comes to not only. Um, some of the tactics of business, but also in terms of that, that process of physically setting up your business too. Okay, thank you.